Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we find ourselves out in sunny California. Well, not exactly sunny at the time of this video anyway, but there's enough light in the area to understand that this San Francisco is not exactly playing with the full deck. As if any sovereign citizen would play with the full deck anyway, which may be a contributing factor to this uh, paint chip eating softard getting arrested and his truck towed. So let's sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Is there a reason you need to be lighting me up with your light, sir? What? Is there a reason you're, you're, you're rolling up on me, harassing me as usual? Yeah, uh, uh, yes, sir. No plates. So you're parked in the middle of the street? And your vehicle doesn't have a license plate on it, my man. That has nothing. There's, is that a crime? Yes, you cannot, it is. No, it is not a crime. Violation of 5200 of the California vehicle. No, it is not a crime. crime. Of course it is a crime, you lead paint drinking shithead. As the officer said, here's the penal code right here. Now, do take some time and read it. Hey, my man, don't reach in the car, my man. Just come back here. Is your vehicle registered? Do you have a plate for it? I'm not answering any questions. I have not committed any crime. Where's hey, the victim? Listen. Ah, yes, the no victim, no crime argument that you sovereign citizens and frauditors tend to use. Well, I hate to break it to you, but you know that argument is complete bullshit. And here's why. Because the Tenth Amendment allows the states to create the laws that are not covered within the Constitution, and thus the uh, states have the right to control the traffic using laws, and therefore it becomes a crime when you violate those laws. Are you able to comprehend that simple concept, King Musabi, or do I need to speak a lot slower so your simple mind can grasp the concept? You're not going to roll up on me. No, you listen. You're not no, going to roll up on me and me harass like me. You're going to stop talking to me like this. Reset. I'm asking you about the place for your car because you don't need to have any. Let, you let have no jurisdiction over me, it's nor my, nor my private officer. automobile. And nor, nor what, there's no, and there's no crime Maryland. committed. You're not going to roll up on me and start inspecting hey, my sir, vehicle. Step look, away from my vehicle. Step hey, away from my automobile. This is my private automobile vehicle, by private property. Yeah, and it's parked on a public roadway blocking. I'm not blocking anyone. Yes, it's, where's, where's someone blocked? There's no one back You're there. You're blocking the lane of traffic. What's your name and badge number? Identify. It's Deputy Chappelle. Okay, you gibbering idiot. Let me recap what the cop just said. You are on a public road blocking a lane and you have no plates. You are committing a crime with the plates alone. You are now subject to fines and penalties. If you do not comply, they will put you in a shiny new pair of bracelets and they will haul you off to jail. But we all know that's the outcome of this story anyway, so let's continue on. Oh, Chappelle, 5426. What's your name and badge number, sir? Hey, sir. I am in, I'm no threat to you. I am no threat to anyone, and I am not, and I am no combatant. You have no right to search my vehicle, make any cursory inspections. I get, I consent to absolutely zero inspections. I'm not gonna. I'm zero threat to you. I'm not gonna make any moves toward you. You're gonna just not inspect my vehicle, my my automobile. Okay. I'm here minding my business. I have every right to do so. Look, sir, if you want to be uncooperative, I will place handcuffs on. No, you will not arrest me and place me under any on any under any. You will not falsely arrest me or falsely accuse me of any crime. I have not committed any crime. Take your hands out of your pocket. I'm not reaching for nothing. I'm putting something in my pocket. Keep your hands out of your pocket. God bless you. Now step back into light where I can be seen. You're going to stand right here. No, I'm not. You're not you have no authority over me, you're sir. Gonna, you're, you're not going to just come over here and bully me. I'm trying to figure out what's going on. Nothing's going on. Something There's nothing wrong here. You're not going to keep yelling at me. I'm not going to keep yelling at you're you. Acting, then. I'll speak with you. But you're not going to come over here really and... You're ridiculous, right? No, you're coming over okay. here gaslighting me. No. <laughs> no, they're not gaslighting you. And I don't suppose you're gaslighting them either because all you're doing is regurgitating this uh, sovereign citizen garbage and have no freaking clue how any of this stuff works because you haven't followed Dorothy down the yellow brick road so you can go see the wizard and get your damn brain. No, we're not. You guys know exactly who I am. I'm Logan Chase Morton. You are not going to you are not going to do you're going to run no games on me. Sir, yeah, what I need you to do is I need you to relax and calm down and we can I'm have perfectly a fine. conversation. Y'all can go about your business. There's no crime committed no, here. I just explained to you why we're here. There's no crime committed. Period. Well, can you uncover Period. the VIN number? Period. 
No, you have no, you have no right to. That is my property. You have no right to to intrude and and encroach upon my rights. Exactly. You are not. You're not going to. You're not going. You're not going to. Then you're not going to violate my rights. I have no obligation to speak to you. Call your supervisor. No, that's not how it works. Yes, it is. No, you, I'm not. I'm not under your authority, sir. Okay, I'm under the authority of God. You understand that? Yeah. Try that in court. Go tell the judge that. Uh, you're above the law because God said you were. I'm under the authority of God Almighty. My name is Logan right, Morton. Turn around, Logan. Put your hands Don't touch me. Do not touch me. Don't do not touch me. No, call you. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Do not touch me. Do not touch me. Get your hands off of me. Get your hands off me. Call. Hey, call somebody. Call. Hey, you can't. You have no right to touch me. Get your hands off. Here, get me. Get my phone. Give it, no, give I'll get it. Stay right there. Hey, no, you guys are trying to violate every right of mine. Get your hands off of me. Well, now the Sobtard hands the camera off to somebody else, probably a friend or something like that. And this guy is a much better cameraman than him. So now we get to see the arrest in all its glory. You have no right to do anything to me. You have no right to do anything to me. I'm not committed any crime. You, you guys know this. The, you are on the road with no license. You guys know this. I'm zero threat to you. Did we ever say you're a threat? You're putting your hands up like I committed a crime. Like I committed a crime. We are detaining you because the you way no right you're trying to walk around. I'm you just closing my hood. Okay, you have no plates on your vehicle. That has nothing to do with the You, you I are have in the zero middle. obligation. You just stand, you just into my wrist. I'm going to sue the absolute shit out of you. What is your okay. name and badge number? I already gave it to you. No, you did not. Yes, I did. Then I identify again because five, you five, did four. not. You have zero obligation to put plates on your vehicle says who because if you don't put plates on your vehicle you're going to be subject to fines over and over again every time you get pulled over it'd be a lot cheaper for you just to leave them on your vehicle i mean i pay less than 50 dollars a year for the tags on my car to keep them up to date i can't imagine how many thousands of dollars i'd be spending on fines if i just all of a sudden one day said, oh, I'm not going to have any tags on my car anymore. You have injured me. You have just, you have just injured me. That's not what happened. Get, I do not consent to any searches to see. Get you away from me. You have to make sure you have no guns or anything. Get me, get, uh, you have, I'm zero sure. threat to you. We can, I, we can talk right here. You are not placing me in your car. I'm staying right here, and we can talk all day because I haven't committed a single crime. Call your supervisor. He's actually right here. Right here. Good. I'm right. No, I have no obligation to move anywhere. I have not committed a single crime. You just, you just injured my wrist. You just assault. You committed assault and battery. You placed me under false detainment because you are violating my rights. Yes, you absolutely are. I'm standing here minding my business. These people come up on me, knowing exactly you know who I am. Y'all, you know I'm exactly not in this. What you're doing. Oh, you don't know him? No, you could be here. Take yeah, totally fine to report you exactly. a single You know him? Yes, it is. You're not going to just come up here and take me to jail for you're absolutely zero like reason like you talking. do all the time, all day. Jeez, take some responsibility for your life, dude. Quit blaming others for your issues. You didn't want to put plates on your vehicle, and your vehicle ended up breaking down in the middle of the street. The next thing you know, the cops show up, thinking that they're going to help somebody out. But oh no, you don't have your plates. That is an offense against the law, you moron. So therefore, you committed a crime. You got to do the time or pay the fines. You want someone to blame for all this? Look in a damn mirror. Car, what do you, what do you think Go you're doing? Car. Go to the car for what? Do do? Go, who are you? Who are you? You are not. You are not God Almighty. You are not the God of life. I didn't commit a single crime. I have every right to defend myself. I have every right to defend myself like a soap and No, you're not going to just do this to me. No, I'm not. You're going to take me out and kill me somewhere now? What, what, what time is it? You call my car? I'm not asking you what the hour was. I'm not asking you what the hour was. Well, I think the best way to de-escalate the situation here is for you to put a sock in your own mouth and shut it. Are you with him? Or are you just filming? He's with him. He is with him. Hey, if he's willing to give...
give the keys to you. Will you take your car? I know, I, but I gotta ask. I'd rather do that than, than have it towed. If he if he's willing to give you the keys, will you take the car? Can you nod yes or no, maybe at least? Yes or no? So you're not willing to take the car? All right, then we'll tow it. Well, now the video carries on for about another 10 minutes until it stops. So I'm just going to stop it right here. And the vehicle was towed. So he didn't get out of this one like he thought he would. At any rate, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one.